Hey, yo, you brothers and sisters and misters and misses. Today, we are back with... Ah, oh, shit. I trust you're ready <laughs> for your okay. first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe yeah. I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. Wait, you isn't Hogwarts, like, kept a secret? secret? Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Now? Yes. yes. Your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Yeah, I know. I'm that guy. I'm the GOAT. Oh, ooh, <laughs> ooh, what's this? If those fall on the floor, who's gonna clean them? What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would no be problem. wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Thank you, Professor. But ah, what okay, do you mean so... keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. This way. Hang on, hang on, hang on. For... I certainly would have appreciated something like a field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. Oh, where'd you go? Uh, okay, thank you. I've been practicing. Yeah, I'm just looking. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding lore. All right. Do keep up. <coughs> Ooh. Why don't you cast Revelio on that statue and see what details the field guide can provide? Lumos. Oh shit. Oh. Revelio. Okay, okay, uh. Okay, uh, I feel okay. Hmm. No, I'm not trying to. Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. Ooh. Okay. So, like, are we supposed to be a chosen one of this story or something? I ain't gonna lie. I fucking hate to live in it. Who the fuck is this guy? Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Yeah, I got this. You know, so I've seen, I've seen the movies. <laughs> I'm kidding. I am not. Oh, they want me there. Okay. Should have been a Ravenclaw or a Hufflepuff. I'm still angry about that. And here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. Ooh, okay. Uh, you can get uh, almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. 
Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. What did I learn in Charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, Spells charms, charms, jinxes. jinxes. All terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard and a talented teacher. Oh, he's clever and talented like me. Thank you. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. Who's that? You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. What is... Thank you, Professor <coughs> thing. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion yeah, is we lost a guy. to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Mm. Oh, yeah, because I forget. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Yeah, remember? Oh. Must have been burning. Uh -oh. Yes. Lips you seem sealed. to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. Whoa, 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 yo, you say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, you, you try, 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 try. chose us. Very well. Enough chit chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Hang on, hang on. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. All Come right. find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll Holy explain shit. more about I'm those crap. assignments I mentioned. Um. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Wish our common Rebellion. There's one. There's one here. There's gotta be one here. <gasps> what is this? Yo, what's up, my dude? Good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today, before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? I did try to evade her questions, though I feel a little perceptive. That said, I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, you think? Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. 
It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. Uh, okay. Let's... <coughs> the map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls Is he going to be like the final boss? To master within these Something. Walls. Rebellion. Oh, what is that? What is that? Hey, 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 hey. Where'd he go? 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 I think hey, hey, you come back here. Yeah. Ah, come on. Come on. Shit. Wait, am I supposed to hit it? I want to see if I can hit it. I'm sorry. You might think this is like a little... So I question our trouble. Do it to this one. <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. How do I wait? Can, can I hit you? Ah, uh, no, nah, I'm not going to hit you. Fellas, oh my God, oh my God, it's a cat. Wait, wait, nope, nope, I'm 18, I'm 18, I'm 18, I'm 18, I cannot do this. Actually, out of 50 is usually. Oh, 
Ugh. Raven Claw. And then the werewolves joined the goblins, goblins in the uprising. Werewolves, where were you? In the Goblin Rebellion of 1752. And by the end of it, the Minister for Magic was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. Oh, what fun! I won't say my goodbyes. I shall cheer for the boy who says you're telling lies. I'm not telling lies, Peeves. It was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. It was Basil Flack. Oh, fine! It's a bold attack! Was the Minister of Flack? The Minister of Flack! Stop it, Peeves, you'll get us in trouble! In trouble you will be, but you can't get Peeves a smack! She said it's a boot, and he said it's a flag! Peeves, enough! You'll get us a Alright, I will fuck all of y'all up. And I. Jesus Christ, is, is this. <sighs> Okay, he was supposed to be the uh, the douchebag of the class. Here, behind you, there is an open seat here. Yeah. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing Obliviator oh, one another. <laughs> oh, 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 yeah, I forgot. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hey man, they're in the summer. That we are in dire need of review. Some stuff just Everyone moved it out. And take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are, and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, first try, what first try. That? No, you just off the cobwebs. Learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics, oh, look at it, what? And I'm that guy. I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion. Outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. Huh. Yeah, I should really watch the movies. I read one book and that was it. I watched one movie. Only. All right. <sighs> I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? This is like college. <laughs> so. Play college what and keep better watching. than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna assume that while this teacher is joyful, the other teacher is a hard ass. I'm going to assume. <laughs> so why don't we have our new <gasps> students? They just use. Hmm? What? <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Okay, okay, they're gonna tell me what to do. Very simply, cast Akio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Akio, uh, think of this like very good. Oh no! Don't worry. Oh. Excellent control there. F 50. 
Let's go! No, it's too easy. It's too easy. That first one was just a test drive. Let's go, let's go, let's go in. Yeah! All right! Very good. Points to Slytherin. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Ah, Miss bring it, I, bring it. Would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. What she got? You'll be the blues just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. Yeah. Oh my gosh, she's gonna. Come on, come on, come on, come on, get to the 50, get to the 50, get to the 50. Come on, 50, 50, 50. Very good. Is it kind of? Yeah, dang it. Roll off, roll off, roll off. Oh, God. Okay, okay. There we go. Okay, okay. No, 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 no. Alright, alright, and boom. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Please, please, please. No! Don't lose your composure. Ah. Uh, <laughs> I love. I love. That is how I need. Ah, uh, yeah. I lost. I lost. It's, it's over. Boom. Now nah, this one's about to fall off. Uh, <laughs> well done. Are you lucky? I didn't get the fifty. Uh, you lucky? You lucky that if that one didn't fall off, I could have won. <laughs> make this a bit more interesting shall we yes we gotta run that back we gotta run that back that was actually pretty fun oh. if we, okay i think we are well past interesting at this point i'll say enough chatter focus now you will need it this round settles it all what are you talking about i lost she's gonna win this somehow oh. Ah, uh, yep, yep, I'm screwed. I'm screwed. Yeah. I'm trying to play it safe for some reason. That was. Nah, she's about to win. Here we go. No, it counts. It counts. There we go. <gasps> it doesn't count. No. Alright. Mm. Oh, oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, <laughs> God. I lost. I lost. Oh, oh, wait. Hold on. Oh, my God. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I, I'm taking it. Yeah, I'm taking this L. I'm taking this L. Alright, uh, it's cool. I'll take that L. And... <clears throat> if I could have knocked her out of the fifth. Damn. Ah, GG's, GG's, GG's. Damn. That was. Very good, both of you. Well done. Hold that L. Hold the L. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Now we're gonna have to run that back. Well done back there. You took the loss in stride. Didn't want to go too easy on you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier. I promise. You have to run it back. Run it back. I'm holding on. I'm, I'm going to be humble. I appreciate your confidence. Thank you. I transferred you. here Thank from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country.
Okay, I'm gonna answer all of these. How big is Uganda? What does it look like? What does Uganda look? You, you got. Uh, oh, oh, that does. Is the magic same? This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. What do they use there? You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. No, I just had some flair. Just add some flair. It's not dramatic. How big is... is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it never that. seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. What is that? Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? It addresses mountains of the moon. It is not so much a castle as a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. I remember the first time I saw it, the mist was so thick, I could hardly make out anything at all. And then it just materialized before me, this enormous school that seemed to be floating in midair. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better, Better not, not keep him waiting. Him. Until yeah. next time. Okay. Of course. A word of hand if you would. On humans. If you wanted to speak with me, Professor. I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation. <laughs> well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? Miss Onai is a talented witch. Take it in stride. One often gains the most from the battles one has lost. Of course, Professor. It was a challenging match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Alright. Yeah. Is this how much? Hello there. You're the new student, aren't you? Hello. You wanted to speak to me. Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Yeah, I'm pretty popular. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. Yeah, you know. Um, kind of you to say humble or non-humble. I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be overconfident in his. Yeah. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. Okay, okay. No. No. I found my recording. 29 minutes. Okay. Alright, after this, I think I'm gonna end the video because when you come to school to learn, you came here to kill children. I mean, to. Jesus Christ. So 
Oh, oh. Professor Hackett! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. <laughs> to the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso. A levitation charm. Levioso. A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable <laughs> is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Yep. Yeah. yeah, yeah, you know. Bippity-boppity-boo, you know, all that kind of stuff. I'm that now, guy. Let's I'm try him. something a little larger. Yeah, they can let you wear it. Let us begin with a basic cost. See how the dummy deflected your cost. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cost. Remember, Levioso. Now, the basic cost. Yeah, yeah, you know. Very good. But the best way to practice is by duel. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. <laughs> so okay, you want to smoke. Now, I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. Alright, this one I feel like I can. This should be easy. Levioso. <laughs> lucky. Nothing lucky for your battle. Yeah. This is going to be your first duel. Let's just say you're good. Now perceptive. Thank you. Well, the duel this on you. Oh, it's triangle. Protego. Protego. The face thing. Let's go. I do. Come on. Come on. Yeah, come on. Not bad oh, for a beginner. You give as good as you get. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Slytherin. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelow's entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. Okay. Okay, miss. All right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. If you know the right spells, it's dark wizards that'll fear you, not the other way around. Oh, I'm not much for dueling. I prefer to keep nice to friendly. 
Nice to meet another brother. Nah, nah it's cool, it's cool. Yeah, Pat. I'm Yushi. Nice work. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Yeah. Practice. Felt more like I was dueling an expert. Yeah, Didn't you know, I'm just that guy. To be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. In fact, it was. Perhaps I have a knack for it. Be coy if you like, but I know better. Magic requires intention and talent. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Hmm? Exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's yep. joining a secret dueling club, or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Oh, I always get caught. I'll keep that in mind. Sebastian? Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck, or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Till next time. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna end this video here. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, join the notification squad. And until next time, uh, brothers and sisters and misses and misses.